praises to God as Amrita and her kind Lord Danvantari, the supreme source of all healing, may we be blessed with their love flow. What do the avatars say about integral harmony communication? In Bhagavad Gita, Vasudev Krishna says in the 10th chapter, 38th verse, Maunam Shaivamsi Guyanam. Maunam means silence. And also, I am Guyanam of secrets. So, of secrets, I am silence. It is a great secret, a very valuable secret, to keep silence, both to keep secrets and also to give the trust as a listener. A trusted listener who can be silent and actually listen and really try to understand the speaker, that is a very great gift, very important skill. Further, in Bhagavad Gita 17th chapter 15th verse, it is said, Anudvega karam vakyam satyam priya hitam chayat svadhyaya yabhasanam chayeva van mayam taupa uchate. Austerity of speech consists in speaking truthfully and beneficially and in avoiding speech that offends. One should also recite the revealed scriptures regularly. Truthfully speaking is pretty self-evident. Beneficially speaking, though, is um, a little bit more difficult for us. We can see that very often. So what actually constitutes beneficial speaking? Beneficial speaking is a kind of speech that uplifts the person from their situation, from their state of consciousness, and helps the person step by step expand their consciousness through the gunas, from tama over rajas to sattva, and from that um, give them a chance to connect with the transcendent Nirgun reality, the transcendental reality, and in avoiding speech that offends. So criticizing others, minimizing others, and um, pretending to understand others when we have not, etc etc this is also not beneficial speech so we should learn what is respectful speech non-offensive speech and this will of course be aided by regularly reciting the revealed scriptures like the Vedas One another example is from the Srimad Bhagavatam, the fourth canto, thirteenth chapter, eighth verse. And there the eight armed form of Vishnu is speaking to the Prachetas. Sri Bhagavan Uvacha Varam Vrindvam Badram Vo Yuyam Nripanandana. 
so hard in a pritak damas to stow hung suridena va. The Supreme Personality of God had said, My dear sons of the King, I am very much pleased by the friendly relationship among you. All of you are engaged in one occupation, devotional service. I am so pleased with your mutual friendship that I wish you all good fortune. Now you may ask a benediction of me. So the Supreme Lord is pleased because all of the prachetas, the sons of the king, are occupied in their soul nature, which is devotional service, serving their source soul, the Supreme Personality of Godhead. And he is especially pleased with their mutual friendship, which of course depends on integral harmony communication respect and serving, helping each other in the service of God. Therefore, when we try to serve God and follow our soul nature, we have to do it in a mood of mutual friendship, not by competing with each other in an envious way. And if we learn to cooperate by implementing integral harmonication, then this friendship can flourish and the Supreme Lord will be very happy to give benedictions to us, which can further enhance our spiritual development. Your comments and questions are most welcome. Please also see the links in the description below. May the Om Love be with you. For the benefit of all, you are heartily invited to click the like button and share this video with all. Jai Shri Radhe Shyam.